He was able to write something that was so strong and succinct, that had such great characters, that was able to kind of build drama in an environment that I'd never seen a dramatic film in. I mean, how does a young writer find a way to make this, um, uh, this tense drama in the world of a music school? You know, when I first read it, you know, my first thought is, uh, wow, this is Full Metal Jacket at Juilliard. Whiplash is also the story of talent and everything that comes with it. It's about desire. It's about what someone is willing to do to be successful. And it takes this very unusual arena, the arena of jazz drumming, and presents a character who is given all the talent and all the skill to be one of the greats and asks the question, what are you willing to sacrifice? What are you willing to give up? What gets exciting about this film is anytime these two characters clash, anytime Isles and JK uh, uh, come at each other and we don't know which one's gonna come out on top. And what's exciting is to watch, you know, Miles go from the student to the master, and uh, not uh, only as a drummer, but, you know, psychologically. Whiplash is a great experience as a film in that um, it's kind of five films in one. You know, you know this is obviously a coming-of-age story. This is a story about talent and music. Uh, this is almost a terrifying story in the way you watch this uh, uh, teacher deal with a student. Um, and it's a very thoughtful movie about the question of sacrifice and the way we spend our minutes and hours and what we're willing to put into the things that we love. So hopefully uh, Whiplash, this very small movie that has this beautiful little origin in this short film, will actually turn into a, uh, a movie that can reach anybody. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey You Guys!